In this video, we will be uh, discussing on update statistics sampling rate. I'll be using AdventureWorks GW database for this demo. I'm going to execute this query to um, uh, check what all uh, statistics are created on object dim employee. I'm able to see three statistics created. Uh, two statistics are auto created and one statistics uh, which is on the primary key column. Uh, is basically um, a um, uh, statistic that was created as part of the cluster index that was um, created when the primary key was defined. So I'm going to pick up this particular uh, statistics and then what I'm going to do is like I'm going to execute it, um, the DPCC show statistics um, and what I'm able to see is like I'm able to see that uh, we have close to 296 rows on this uh, um, uh, object dim employee and the row sampled is uh, close to uh, 296. So that means like the last update statistics that happened on uh, January 12, 2023, which is like nine days from today, um, uh, it was a full scan. So now what I'm going to do is like, I'm going to update the statistics on dim employee with a sample percentage of 40 percent so let's go ahead and do that this is completed so let's check the um, uh, st st statistics details for uh, dim employee again and what I'm seeing is like uh, 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 even though I have used a uh, 40% sample rate for uh, uh, updating the statistics on DIM employee, uh, we were able to uh, uh, see that um, it has performed um, update statistics with full scan. If you can see here, uh, updated date is uh, January 21, 2023, which is today. So uh, the understanding is like it will be a, a full scan or um, update statistics with a sample rate of 100%. Um, uh, in case um, uh, if you have uh, uh, a table that is uh, basically having uh, fewer than 1024 pages. So no matter uh, what sample rate you provide, you will basically be uh, performing um, a full scan that is uh, update statistics with full scan or 100%. If the total number of pages as far as this table is concerned is uh, below 1024 pages. So what we'll do is like we will check this particular um, object uh, dim employee and also we will check one more object and see how many pages we have on these two objects so as far as dim employee is concerned I'm able to see 296 rows but the total number of pages seems to be close to 690 uh, since it is lower than 1024 if you do an update statistics even if you give a sample rate it is always going to be a tables a full scan um, uh, so um, uh, it will be performing an update statistics with uh, uh, full scan since uh, the total number of pages is below 1024 now we see that uh, the object fact product inventory has got close to uh, like 3961 uh, pages and uh, close to 7,76,286 rows. So what we'll do now is like uh, we will uh, check for um, the available statistics on fact product inventory table. So what I'm able to see is like we are having close to uh, um, uh, uh, three statistics and uh, the first one that we are seeing which is created as part of the cluster index PK underscore fact product inventory. Uh, product key and date key is um, uh, present on that particular statistics and as far as the other two uh, auto created statistics those are single uh, column statistics and um, uh, what I'm able to see is that um, there are close to three statistics here. So what I'm uh, interested in is like the primary, um, uh, the first uh, statistics which is created as part of the primary key. So what I'll do is like I will check the statistics value for that and what I'm seeing is like uh, the last time <clears throat> The last time the statistics was updated on this particular uh, table is on uh, uh, 12 Jan 2023, which is close to nine days from today. Uh, uh, it is like uh, before nine days from today. And uh, now what I'm going to do is like I'm going to update the statistics on fact product inventory table with a sample of 40%. Let's see what happens. So it is completed. So let's look at the data again. 
if I see here, what I'm able to see is like um, uh, uh, we have close to 7,76,286 rows and uh, the number of uh, rows sampled is like uh, 3,17,556. So let's do the math and see like how much um, uh, percent we are getting. So what I'm going to do is like I'm dividing rows sampled by rows and I will multiply it by 100 to get a uh, percent value so what I'm seeing is that it is close to 40.9 which is um, which is um, a, a close to what we have provided which is uh, 40 percent yeah so now what we'll do is like we will update the statistics uh, on fact product inventory with a full scan and then let's look at the statistics again and let's see what happens so if I execute it what I'm seeing is like this time uh, we are able to see that um, we have 7,76,286 rows and row sampled is also same since we used a, a full scan to update the statistics. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Jai Hind.